a squall. So uh, it's my pleasant duty to welcome you here. Um, I, I don't know how much you saw, so the, the northeastern quadrant of the campus is where we are in engineering. A lot of our facilities are actually quite new. You know, this auditorium is just about a year and a half old. The Fung Institute is right across the street. It's this place, and that'll be uh, sort of the home for the programs, the home away from the departments. You know, you will also have a home in the departments, but there is a place where there'll be uh, student support, classrooms, workplaces, both here as well as in the Bechtel Engineering Center. So we've been fixing up the college to prepare for uh, the uh, onset of the MEng program. So today it's uh, really my job to just say th for three minutes, you know, to welcome you. We, I, I think most of you were at uh, dinner last night when we talked about the genesis of the program. So I certainly won't repeat it, and actually I don't want to steal the thunder of my uh, colleague uh, Jitendra to to put this uh, all together. So um, I hope you have a good time uh, here today. Uh, Melissa just I mean, when, when <laughs> gave me the things that I should say in addition to. Uh, I told some of you this at uh, d dinner again yesterday. You know, we've had a very, very substantive review. I congratulate you on having received our letters of admission for this one-year accelerated Master of Engineering program. There was departmental review of your folders, there was Fung Institute review of your folders, and we think that this is definitely a program for students who want a thorough grounding in not only in today's science and technology, but also those who aspire to leadership and the management of technology and industry. And, you know, the roles, we call them CXO roles in industry. So our professional master's program combines in-depth coursework in technology innovation and management with intensive study in an engineering field. We really hope that the inaugural cohort and all future cohorts will finish the program as a closely lit cohort and develop the networks. And I think at dinner yesterday, Coleman was saying how important it was for the networks to be able to propel you throughout your uh, professional careers. The program is definitely decided to be a fast-track program and to fast-track you to, into the workforce, into influential positions. And I really want to underline the word influential positions. We expect uh, graduates of this program to be at the table when big decisions are made. Big decisions are made in, in industries, in all, all, all in industries, in, in other stakeholders, you know, possibly in utilities and those kinds of places where big decisions are made about the future of green tech, investments in green tech, information technology, social networks, uh, data analytics, you know, it's just a whole host of new opportunities that are emerging. All our in industry leaders are, uh, are telling us that we, that, th that we should expect to see all of our graduates to be really sought after for key industry roles in Silicon Valley and other high-tech hubs. There, they tell us that there is a huge need for talented engineers who understand the innovation process and have the people skills to lead interdisciplinary teams. Our corporate partners, and there are a lot of corporate partners, and you'll, you, they'll be coming through on a pretty regular basis, really endorse the whole program design, you know, the whole T concept that Jatendra is going to tell you about, and they're especially really on board with the capstone project, the hands-on capstone project, they're on board with its concept uh, about being industry relevant. They're on board with the idea of groups working together. And they're really on board with the idea of working on real world problems. So I think that uh, you know you're going to be the inaugural cohort, but there's a lot of homework that we've all done to get to this point. And of course, uh, as there's a huge amount of enthusiasm on the faculty to welcome you and to have you do this. So without further ado, I'd like to introduce our Associate Dean for New Academic Initiatives, Jitendra Manik, who will speak by the program. Jitendra. 